what's good my people I hope you guys are having a blessed and beautiful day you guys already know my slogan I don't need no high beast to tell me what sneaker is cool or fire if you know fire sneakers you know let's go today I do have Yeezys on the table this sneaker is not mine this is for a friend and I don't I just want to see what the hype is about this Yeezys collaborations so I told my friend if I can borrow one of his Yeezys to review and he gave me the 350s so I'm just gonna see what's going on with this sneaker alright on this side of the sneaker as you guys can read we have the boost I so I'm sorry on this side of the box we have the boost on top we have 350 and on this side we have Yeezy Boost 350 and then we, we have made by Adidas on this side okay let's read the label the label reads Yeezy Boost 350 V2 the size is 10.5 the color is ash blue ash blue ash blue and it's made in Vietnam I don't really know how much this cost even though he did purchase this on the aftermarket so he paid more for the sneakers so to be honest I don't know the retail price and I don't know how much he paid for the sneakers I just want to see what the hype is about the 350s or the Yeezy sneaker okay let's open the box I do like the sliding box this is the sneaker okay this is the 350 Yeezy Boost V2 first of all let's talk about the design I'm not a big fan of the design when it comes to the sneaker I do like the high tops when it comes to the Yeezys I like the high tops I like the I like the black colorway and I like the gray colorway those are the two colorways I think he had and I like both colorways for the high tops when it comes to the design on this I don't like the design and I think this silhouette is one of the silhouettes that almost everybody that collects sneakers or like sneakers have when it comes to the Yeezy sneakers which is a good thing for him because he's gonna make a lot of money off of these sneakers okay the colorway on the sneaker too I'm not a big fan I like the white one that I've seen French Montana rocking for a while before they released it if I'll ever purchase the 350s I think that would be the one for me the all white okay the colors on this sneaker like it says on the box ash blue ash blue ash blue you guys can tell it's all gray colors and we have blue accents on the sneaker all different types all, all shades of gray and we have this gold color or yellow color in the middle on the side of the sneaker and the materials on this sneaker we have mesh material all over the sneaker and then we have rubber on the sole of the sneaker alright let's let's check the outsole on the outsole like I said we have rubber on the outsole and we have lots of boost technology in the sole and one thing about the boost technology is I think Adidas do this the best compared to any company it makes the sneaker so comfortable even when they put it even when they put the boost in their slides it makes the slides comfortable so I think they do this when, when it comes to the comfort thing or the boost thing I think they do it better than Nike that's my personal opinion you can you can decide if you think your Nike reacts are better than the boost that's on you but to me I think the boost is better than the reacts technology that Nike use so on the midsole of the sneaker we have all clear rubber on the midsole of the sneaker as you guys can see and the colors on the sneaker all like I told you guys is all shades of gray and we have this gold color in the middle on the side of the sneaker the laces on this sneaker is gray as you guys can see let's check inside of the sneaker we don't have a shoe tree we do have paper 
the sack lining is very soft and we have three stripes on the sack lining let's check the, let's check the insole of the sneaker the insole of the sneaker we have adidas printing we have adidas logo and we have yeezy's printing on the insole of the sneaker i don't really have too much to say about this sneaker i was just trying to find out what the hype is when it comes to this yeezy sneakers and why people buy lots or a lot of colorways of this sneaker let me see what year was this sneaker made in particular this sneaker was made or released in november 2020 so this is one of the new ones when it comes to the 350 boost v2 the sneaker itself is not that bad but i just don't like the design and I think the silhouette is not that bad too because if you get a better colorway you can still rock it. But that's it. That I, that's all I have on this sneaker. So I would like you guys to tell me what you like about this sneaker. What you don't like about this sneaker. Do you think you will rock it or not? And please if you haven't subscribed to the channel. Subscribe and hit the like button for me. Okay. I'll, I'll give you guys updates on this if I can or I'll tell you guys my opinion in the future if I think I can rock this sneaker. Okay, I love you guys. Take care. Get money. Stay out of the way and be blessed. I'm out.